Alright dolls, so I recently traveled to Mexico with Liam and this is the second time that I've traveled with him. So in today's video, I thought I would share some tips on how to make traveling with a baby a lot easier and more enjoyable. So with that being said, let's get started. All right, so tip number one for traveling with a baby toddler is to pack lots of snacks. Now, as you can see, this is very bulky, and if I took all this with me, it would literally take up so much space in my luggage. So I found these portion control snacks that you can buy pretty much anywhere. I found them at Target, and you can fill those up, and it's great because you know how much exactly you're giving to your baby. Um, they come like I think a half a cup, a cup, and two cups. Um, so you can fill up all his snacks and put them in there and they're so easy to travel with and then seal them and close them and they're a lot smaller to travel with. still nursing Liam I need to eat as well so I'm taking some cliff bars for myself some food puree for Liam in these travel packs and then of course some almonds for myself as well because of course there's nothing worse than a hungry mommy and then Liam's snacks um, plenty of food for me and plenty of food for Liam on the plane um, just disregard my Halloween Ziploc bag Tip number two saved me so much time and hassle because baby clothes are very small so you can lose them fairly quickly. So what I like to do is shove all the accessories into this canvas like bag. These bags you can get from when you buy a purse um, or shoes sometimes come in a canvas bag and literally just throw in all the accessories so you don't lose them and then put that inside your luggage and it's golden. Now what I did for Liam's clothes is that I put them all in a bag like this one. This one is very soft and it fits perfectly in my big luggage so that way I don't lose any of Liam's clothes since baby clothes are small. Everything just kind of fits in that perfectly. Now on to our carry-on items. I've never had to travel internationally before um, with a baby, so now there's three of us. Um, so I wanted to make room in my wallet, that way I can put all of our passports in one place and not lose them. So what I'm doing is just taking out all my gift cards that I have on one side, so that way it can create some space and I'm able to put all three of our passports in my wallet and not lose anybody's. All right, so for any traveling mommies, I recommend to get a very good sturdy backpack. I don't recommend diaper bags because, well, that's just not travel friendly. So when you get a diaper bag, um, or backpack I mean, um, they're gonna come with these really cool mats that you can lay down, you know, to change the baby, like changing pad. And I like to shove a diaper, wipes, and butt spray um, in one of those so I can just easily grab that and have that whenever I need to change Liam. And then of course I have like 10 diapers on deck ready just in case anything happens and then of course I got to add in my snacks in my backpack and then extra change of clothes because you never know what kind of accidents may happen a bib um, my wallet and my phone Okay, so I forgot to mention that I also added this in my carry-on because these are also necessities. Um, I have a foaming dish and bottle soap cleaner, so that's just in case if any of Liam's like toys or pacifiers fall on the ground, I can clean it. Some teething tablets, you never know what can happen on a plane if you can get fussy. I also have Little Remedies gas relief drops. 
um, just in case Liam gets gassy on the plane. I have that. I have Advil in case I have a headache. Um, Band-aids, and these are all things that you will need on a plane, so to take them in a carry-on is crucial. Um, you never know what may happen. Tip number four, bring lots and lots of toys. I cannot stress that enough. So what I did here was I grabbed a, or I bought a necklace um, that actually comes apart. It's a teething necklace. And I hooked on some of Liam's favorite toys that were quiet and don't make a lot of noise. Um, because I don't want to lose, I didn't want to lose any of his toys. So if I hooked everything together, nothing would fall. And then I could basically hook this necklace necklace onto his stroller or around my neck around his neck and you know this is very sanitary because it's not gonna fall on the floor tip five travel smart now this is my outfit I basically threw my hair up in a bun because nobody has time to blow dry your hair and curl it when you have a baby I wore sunglasses because again I don't have time to do my makeup and since I'm still nursing Liam I wore a button-up or a button-down t-shirt so that way I can easily just take off a button nurse him really quick and a big jacket like this one here is perfect because I can cover myself while I'm nursing Liam Liam's outfit is very travel friendly this eight man onesie has buttons to change his diaper really quickly and then his moccasins um, just kind of stay on his feet so I really hope these tips help you guys when traveling with a baby if you guys have any tips then let me know in the comments below um, and I will see you guys in my next video bye